Hi, I'm the tote bag that comes with the fragrance as a gift with purchase, but you give it to your cousin, Trixie Mattel. Hi, and I'm Sydney Prescott's mom, Katya. And welcome to <sighs> the show where we talk about whatever we want. Because it's our show. And not yours. <laughs> <laughs> Cash. Dinero. Checks. Phones. Gold doubloons. Paper. Air. Ducklings. What does it all have in common? Money. Money. That's it's money. Money. <laughs> money is the food of the now. You need money to live and you live for money. Live to eat. Don't eat to live. Don't. That is how that should go. Well, that, yeah, that's the thing. I think that's an Overeaters Anonymous expression. I wouldn't know. I've always been ballerina thin. There was a girl in my college who always ate like six walnuts for lunch, and she was like, I'm trying to focus on foods that fuel my body. And you, that's why you keep a food and journal. And it's right. We're here to tell you about keeping a money journal. Not necessarily a physical, but a mental one. We have gone from being the brokest, nobody drag queens that no one cared about who barely could keep their lights on. To mega rich to international superstars. contemporaries with Sharon Stone. Sharon Osborne. Any um, Sharon, any Sharon you can think of. Besides Needle, we share in broke. their fame. Yeah. <laughs> Puns. Um, <laughs> being poor, there's an art to it. Absolutely. Homeless chic is chic for a reason, because it looks cool, but doesn't feel great. Warmth and nourishment are, um, well, they're pretty important. Ask anybody in the Bay Area how much it costs to look poor. We have both spent a great deal of our lives poor. Poor. Um, Some of my favorite things to eat when I was poor were this: ramen noodles. Yeah. And classic. that came through college to adulthood. Yeah, that's a classic. Peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. Yeah. Easy. Keep um, the crust on though. You microwave popcorn. Yeah. Easy Mac. For and that's food. all the four food groups. So you're drink water. Go. Yeah, drink water. I drink of tap water. water. Oh, don't even get me started. Don't even. I, I'm so passionate about this. Do you me. say Brita filter to me? It better be no. a drag queen in a show. No, 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 no. <laughs> in the 90s, if you had told me back then that there would be an entire industry with bottled water that people would spend three to four to five dollars on a bottle of water, I would have said, you're crazy. I'm from the country girl. I remember going out this next to the yard, water out of the ground. Where do you think these fucking white ass choppers come from? The fluoride in the water of the city of Marlboro. And she was on that show where Tyra gives people meth makeovers and they look in the mirror and cry. I still look in the mirror and cry, but it's more out of <laughs> happiness. Yeah. <laughs> what you can do at home is for one day, just make a little economic journal. So you write down every single thing you purchased. Dear diary. Yeah. Today I went to, you know. They still haven't found me. <laughs> you say all the things you, you purchase, and then the next day after a good night's sleep and plenty of water. This which, is called a bank statement, by the way. It exists. You don't need to write oh, it down. Oh, that's right. That's right. I pay a lot in cash, though. When, no, when you need to do banking, you sit at your house with one of those green visors and one of those I paper do, things. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> My yeah. teeth get brown all of a sudden. Yeah. When I say I'm poor, I'm saying that I have no savings. I'm living check to check. You're dodging phone calls. Dodging phone calls, bill collectors, listen, when I blow up, you'll get it. I'm living check to check, and then maybe one or two days out of the week, I have no money. I've had to choose between cigarettes and food, and you know, I'm gonna guess you alert, choose cigarettes. cigarettes. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I've um, exchanged CDs at the local music store for cash. Nobody does that anymore. Nobody does that anymore. Does no. anybody know what a CD is? You can go in there like, I have this file on my iPod. Can I just get a scoop of refried, <laughs> refried beans? I have this USB <laughs> stick with a lot of great tunes on it. With a lot of great drag mixes. Yeah, yeah. Can I just get a stick of gum? How many whip cracks equals lunch? I don't know. <laughs> That's probably none. You need a certain amount of money in order to be able to experience happiness. How am I supposed to look in the mirror when I don't have a mirror? There have never been truer words. I mean, that's deep. I've stolen. Never I've stolen. stolen. I've stolen a lot. I've stolen a lot. A lot I guess it's how good and bad people react to poverty. <laughs> yeah, I, I just probably... pushed on until I found my way. I used knives to get what I want. I was reading a study and it was talking about in 2010, one in 11 people are shoplifters, people who mm -hmm. steal. Almost none of those people were stealing out of true need. Like a man will walk into a store and steal a woman's left shoe. He doesn't need it, but he just wants to feel like he stole something. Yeah, he wants a thrill. I have a suggestion. And I don't Call steal baby formula phone. because I have a baby. I steal it because I don't want other babies to have it. Yeah. You can set your makeup with baby formula powder and you just look so young the next day. That's not Of true. course, you cry like a baby for two days. <laughs> and you shit yourself. <laughs> you go bald. It's you Benjamin Button backwards. <laughs> is Benjamin Button a real thing or is that a movie thing? Girl, what do you think? 
Real thing. Has anybody Half-Life. ever been born an old person and aged into a baby? I don't know. Have they? Explain that, America. Yeah. Explain Chi Chi Davenport. I mean, uh, Chi Chi. Same. Chi-Chi. <laughs> <laughs> Kennedy Davenport is from the future and she went back in time to tell Chi Chi she wasn't going to win Drag Race. That's the real back to the future Benjamin Button Drag Race bullshit. I bet you if you put them in one room, there'd be, you know, that, that dissonance that happens in time travel movies where you can't ever see yourself, everything will get crazy. Are you, you getting, I mean? are you getting on another one of those contacts about the movie? No, it's, about, it's not context. It's not context. Con- it's not context. Everything it's goes not back travel. to context not, No, you. this is a Harry Potter thing. You know, when Hermione couldn't, um, she was going, but she used her time travel thing to go back and, um, yeah, it, it's a long story. But, but I, that comes back to money. It does. Because you need money to go to the movies. And I wouldn't know about that movie if I didn't have any money. So how do you get money? Oh, you hit me where I live right now. <laughs> because <laughs> I'm a wizard and because I don't have money. Wizards with no money, that's like... Dot com. <laughs> Mama. Mama. I'm gonna get a hat that says that for DragCon. Wizards without money. Why isn't com. there a grinder for wizards with no money? I could have gotten laid by now. Fuck. Because wizards wave their magic wand and have money. Oh my Similar God. to the way we stow our magic wand to get singles from people. We look like witches, but we can't actually do anything. Can't help you. No. Can't, we can't even, I can't tongue pop, I can't drag queen for shit. No. Nothing. I can't even dance. I can do a split so that tricks people into thinking I have some kind of ability. My mind, because I've been broke for so long, my brain Busted. is only... Busted for um, <laughs> My brain is only able to, to kind of conceptualize a checking and a savings account. And there's never anything in the savings account, so it's really just a checking account. Now, I just have money everywhere. Oh, especially if you've ever been like a server or a drag queen, you know how much money you have because it's sitting here in yeah. this hamburger-sized stack yeah, that absolutely. smells. Yeah, Holding I have handy. this ritual where oh. I, if each one I lay it out all over the room and sometimes I climb up the walls and I go on my knees and I just, I do some kind of prayer. Well, and like, it, you know, I lick my hand and I touch it to each dollar because if I don't, <laughs> is there a word for this? OCD. Now, listen, I know you've already forgotten to save your money, but please don't forget to subscribe to Wow Presents.